So, hey guys, and today I am going to be recording a video. Um, you might be wondering, why are you doing balloons Tower Defense 6? Well, I uh, just wanted to um, basically uh, take a break from Minecraft because you know, I want to experiment. I want to try different games, you know, see how many likes views, support I get, maybe even subscribers, and just kind of compare that, I might even do Hello Neighbor, but I will be releasing two videos tonight, so this is the first, it is Friday, I am releasing this at 9.15, and yeah, so we're going to start, and today, <clears throat> this video will be very confusing to y'all. And I've been playing this game for about 10 days. And going on to 11. And it's really fun. And I would like to start a series of this. In fact, I will to try it out. Um, and I'll, you know, have like videos about, you know, helping you guys out. Seeing, you know, giving you like. You know tips and tricks for you new players in this game. So I have all the primary military magic and support, so you guys can just take a look at it. At the top, um, at the top of the monkey, you'll see the name, so you can screenshot these. <coughs> Excuse me. So yeah. Um, I've actually, as you can see, I've gone pretty far, but we're going to start in the beginning, start over with you guys, because this is a series for newcomers, and you know all the people that have been playing the game for a while now, so we're going to go easy, standard, over right, save, okay, so in this game you get a hero and currently my monkey is pat fusty okay this is pat fusty and that's my hero and the rest are just you know regular monkeys and actually fun fact these are uh towers disguised as monkeys hopefully i didn't ruin this game for you but uh, there's that so I'm going to start the timer for 10 minutes, cause, uh, yep, yeah. and now let's get on with this video, so, right now, I'm going to place down a dart monkey, um, and this is my dart monkey, and I think I'm going to go for quick shots, long range, Enhanced eyesight, and yeah, that's what I'm gonna go for. So, I'm gonna hit play. We don't have auto start. Okay, we do. So, I'm gonna turn that off. And this is easy mode, so as you can see in the top left hand corner, there's 200 lives and a little bit to the side of it. I have 160 or 170 coins. Then, as you can see, the round is 1 to 40, or 1 out of 40. Um, when you beat the round, you can actually hit free play and go as long as you want. But in, to win the round, in easy mode is 1 out of 40, like I'm doing now. And to win the round in medium mode, it's uh, 1 out of 60. And the lives are actually 150, which you start out with instead of 200. Hard mode, you start out with 100 lives and you have 80 rounds before you can win the game. So, yeah, and right now I'm just placing down these dart monkeys. Um, <clears throat> I always go for bottom row two times and then middle row twice. Um, top row is also good. Um, as you can see, the dart, uh, dart monkey. Um, I unlocked everything on this, but Ultra Juggernaut's good, and Crossbow Master is good. Plasma Monkey Fan Club's good, but it's only really good till you get Plasma Monkey Fan Club, 
and it does cost 42,500 points. So that's kind of pricey. This one only costs 12,750 Ultra Juggernaut, and Crossbow Master only costs 21,250. So you can see the price difference. And um, Super Monkey Fan Club costs 6,800. While Sharp uh, Shooter costs uh, 1700 and Juggernaut costs 1500 So, um, I don't want to go really too much over 10 minutes. It might be before we win. But I'm just going to win this round. I'm not going to continue. So, put down another Dark Monkey right here. And then we're going to. I'll go for Top Path. You always want to go bottom path twice and then see where you're at because if you go bottom path twice as you can see there's like a green dot to the right of the bottom or to the left of the bottom there's like a green dot that's how many times you level up so you're going to want to get two green dots there because you get enhanced eyesight and then you're going to want to either go top or bottom fully and you might be losing some health Actually, nope, we're gonna be good. Yeah, let's see the range. Yeah. So when you tap on your monkey, the circle around it is the range of it. As you can see, with the one with the red bandana has more because he has an enhanced eyesight. So we're gonna get this guy enhanced eyesight. And now they have an equal amount of range. And we're gonna keep going. So we've got about two on each row that we picked. You can only do two rows out of three, so you're going to have to pick between two. And later in other videos, I'll give you more tips on that. So. Right, let's get, um, This guy we're gonna go for Ultra Juggernaut, which again, is Ultra Juggernaut, and we're also gonna go with the other one, Crossbow Master. So that would be, just like it shows here, Ultra Juggernaut is top path and Crossbow Master is bottom. So this guy we're gonna go bottom path, this one, right here, we're gonna go top. And we're gonna keep going, we're gonna get a spike. Shooter, sorry, not spike factor. Um, long range tacks. I like to go for. Um, I usually like to go to middle and then all the way on top. Uh, except I haven't lo unlocked all the way on top, but you know, as far as possible, just for levels on top. So that's what we're gonna do. And at some point, I'd like to get a farm because you can produce more bananas, which gets you coins. And it's just great. Okay, super range. Or I'm sorry, what is this called? I forgot. Okay, super range taxi. Alright, so. We're at round 9 out of 40. Buy 
the last one is a top row and I have none of the bottom row. But the top row I could actually buy. Um, but I still want to do some more research on that. I'm not exactly sure. Super range on it and even faster shooting. I think we can get it really fast. I'm actually gonna put auto start on. Because that means it all starts around the on thing to play. And actually this little lightning bolt down here, if you hit it, it'll show powers on the left side. And these are powers, basically. And there's insta monkey. Watching. If you don't want to use supply crates, and I'm using supply crates, I'm going to be a one step ahead of you or even more because it gives you like uh, 2,500 coins, I think, in each crate. So it gets you pretty far ahead. Um, and I like to kind of stay real with the audience, of course. If I'm doing the video where it's obviously not going to be like Um, these bananas are dropping, so you want to collect them before they go away. And I'm going to upgrade my farm. I want to get a bank. So that means bananas won't drop, because if you don't get a bank, you're going to have to get, like, a farmer monkey, which is a power, and I don't want to have to use powers in this. So we're just going to get this uh, farmer. I'm gonna go for increased production and long life. I'm gonna go two on top and all the way on the bottom. Or two on top and all the way in the middle. Um, that's kinda how I like my farms. That's why I haven't done any of the bottom row because I just don't like that, so. Hopefully you don't go too many, too much more. I'm gonna actually Start the timer for 10 minutes again to see where we're at on time. And hopefully we can kind of crack on with this. Because I don't want these videos to be tons long. Because it can get boring sometimes. And I don't want that. So, um, we're just going long life bananas we have. Um... Yeah, my monkeys in this tag shooter are doing fine. These are doing great. <laughs> Man, tag shooters are helpful. Okay, we're doing good now. Now we're doing good. See, I have two on top, two in the middle. So now I'm going to want to go another in the middle. 
and that will stop the top from being available, which is fine because I don't need the top anymore once I get monkey bank. So we're saving up. And if you go top, like right here, if you go top, you can't get monkey bank. And if you go monkey bank, you can't get uh, top. And the top one is ba uh, banana plantation. And we're not... That hurt. That hurt. That hurt a lot. All right, we're fine. It's it's fine. It's just it was kind of annoying. Uh, I wish I didn't have to do that. Uh, so bottom path and middle path. Okay. So middle path. Bottom path. And. This one right here is Spike Factory. And Spike Factories actually get really overpowered. Like when you get like one of these last ones, I think. Or one of these ones that are close to last. I think it's like one of the last ones. They get super overpowered. They can take out Moabs. Um, if you don't know what Moabs are, there's these big balloons that carry multiple balloons inside of them. Which is kind of scary when you think about it since this game is about monkeys fighting balloons and when you get this huge balloon with you know monkey destroying balloons inside of it it's it's a little bit it's a little bit uh sketch um actually what i want to do is save up for a helicopter because hmm or do i want to save up for an ice monkey because lead balloons are going to come pretty soon. So, and you know what? I'm going to save it for an ice monkey. You're going to get that metal freeze. And we're going to get refreeze on it. Now, this guy's going to be popping some balloons. And this guy doesn't have a trait that will allow him to get camel balloons. So, okay. Yeah, yeah. We're going to be doing fine. Now, I'd like to save up for, like, a bank. Since we're not going to need a helicopter. Yeah, this refreeze is destroying right now. It is really crazy. <laughs> if you could see the ice monkey going crazy over there. Oh, I love that guy. Uh, <clears throat> the refreeze is overpowered. It's crazy on this guy. Refreeze is really, really something else. Something to be... <laughs> Something to be happy about if you get it. Ow. I just cracked my... Yeah, I don't know what I said. All right. So, we're going to put down this helicopter. I can't believe I could fit it right there in that little notch. Oh, my gosh. Ooh, see those lead balloons? Those gray ones right there? That's why I got the ice monkey. Oh, no. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, no. I need metal freeze. Do I have enough now? Nope, I don't have enough. Ugh. Darn. We're gonna be losing some lives unless this guy can take him. No, nope. he's not. Yeah, the lives are gonna be going away. The lives are gonna be going away. It's fine. We're fine. It's, it's, it's okay. Alright, well, that guy got past... Metal freeze on this guy, bigger radius, and then I'm gonna put refreeze on him, so we can knock out these lead balloons, punch them right in the face. All right, we're good now. We got two ice monkeys that could break lead balloons. Hopefully, this doesn't. I don't absolutely get wrecked. Oh come on, oh but yeah, that's why I put that ice monkey there, and this helicopter is pretty soon gonna be wrecking. I mean, not soon, but it's going to be wrecking at some point. Some point in time. Oh, yes. And I need to get Pursuit on this guy. So Pursuit makes it so he follows the balloons. Okay, Pursuit. And now we need to get bigger jets. Actually, I forgot. Yeah. So you want two... Support, mm, that one, that one's a good one, but you kind of, you want, um, two on the bottom and all the way on the top. I don't have all the way on the top, but that's just what I want. So, I think 
I'm going to get the lead destroying one first. So that's 1,485. Again, that's the top one. It's called Razor Rotors. And it says, the description is, Razor Rotor Blades Rip Up uh, Balloons on Contact, Including Lead and Frozen Balloons. See, so when these ice monkeys freeze these balloons, now when I upgrade it, he'll be able to break them. And he'll be able to get lead balloons, which will be awesome. Um, we're not going to upgrade a bigger jet, so we got to wait. Oh, we're so close. Oh, we're in 400. We just need to... Oh, yes. Okay, we got it now. Now we need two on the bottom so we can get camo. As you can see, those camo ones, kind of with that camo stuff on it. He can't see. He's not doing anything to. So we need to get two in the middle. Did I say bottom? Two in the middle. So we want 255 for bigger jets. Got it. And 510 for camo seeking. So we can actually speed this up. Because I don't really care what's going to happen next really too much. Okay, camo seeking. We got it. This guy is going to be powerful. And that's pretty much all we need to do with him. Now I'd like to get a bank here. If we have time and he doesn't destroy all these balloons before we can get a bank. Which is completely possible. I'm not really too worried about this right now. Because I know what's going to be coming. And what's going to be coming is not scary at all to this helicopter. He can destroy all of these guys. And we can win. Okay, we have a monkey bank now. Now we're cooking with gas. And now, as you can see, you have to go in to collect it so it's not spilled out all over the floor. And you have to collect it before, you know, it goes away. Which is nerve-wracking, actually. So I'm going to get another helicopter. Just to kind of taunt the enemy. Pursuit. Da, da, do, da, da. Razor Rotors is going to be here in a second. Oh, wait. Camo. Camo. Pop, camo popping, please. Razor Rotors coming up. It's a 1,485. Okay. Collect from the bank. Oh, yeah, yeah. We got this in the bag. I actually am going to slow this down. Oh, yeah. We're going to win. Watch that. And we won. Victory, we got fifteen dollars. Wow. Well that was something else. So uh that's basically kind of a little look at the game. Um and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did like, um please subscribe, comment, um, you know, comment on what you want to see if you had questions. And yeah. Pretty much that's it. Um, I'll see you in the next video.